Liza P is without a doubt the best reviewed game this month. Sorry Starfield, it's a soul like that's a blast to play lots of fun that'll keep you entertained for at least 40 hours. So does it run on Steam Deck? This video is sponsored by TomTalk and their innovative and fashionable carrying cases for Steam Deck and Rogue Ally. The original Steam Deck dock is bulky, it doesn't fit anything other than the deck and is horrible to carry around. TomTalk sent me these two cases. This one is a slim carrying case, it's actually thinner than the default Steam one. It looks better, is hard shelled and custom fits the Steam Deck for full protection. There's even a little pouch here that'll fit a charging cable. My favorite one though is this travel bag. It's tailor made for the Steam Deck and they also have one for the Rogue Ally. Steam Deck does fit right in here. This W shaped structure protects the joysticks and all the buttons and there's even a strap to hold it all in place. There's more than enough space here to carry your dock, the charger, your phone and a bunch of other accessories. The W shaped cushion actually here is removable if you want to use the bag for other things. This bag is easy and fashionable when you're carrying it around. I do love the look of the bag. If it's something you're interested in, check the links and discount codes in the description. Eliza P is on Steam where it shows as playable. The only warning is about the in-game text being hard to read. Now I myself didn't purchase it on Steam because it's part of Game Pass Ultimate on both Xbox and PC. So why spend the extra money? Plus with Game Pass, my saves get transferred over to the cloud. And that cross save feature between console and PC is amazing. I can play at home on my Xbox and then pick up right where I left off on the go using my Steam Deck. To do this, I did have to install Windows on my Steam Deck. If you're interested in doing that yourself, I'll leave some instructions in the description. Once you have it installed, the game launches without any issues, running 800p resolution with VSync and AMD FSR2 unbalanced. The graphics here are on the low preset. With those settings, the Steam Deck delivers. You can see the frame rate here is at 60 FPS most of the time. There's some minor dips, maybe a frame here and there but overall I'm really happy with the way this game runs on Steam Deck. It's polished the way the games should be released. I've actually played this game on every platform and they did a good job releasing a finished product that's something rare these days. So if you have Game Pass Ultimate install Windows and then try it out on Steam Deck. I'm sure most of you will enjoy this even if you don't have an Xbox or Game Pass then maybe it's worth picking up on Steam. This is a good game. For the rest of the video, I have some more gameplay of Liza P on Steam Deck so you get to see it in action. 